Third linebacker for the Buffalo Royals, Ben Walquist. And Ben, um, quite a 2013 season. Um, talk about what it meant for you and being a part of that club as far as first six games of the year and then having mm -hmm. to obviously watch from the sidelines going mm -hmm. forward. Um, yeah, it was, an, it was an unbelievable season, I think, just uh, from the the team that we had and the chemistry, I don't think I've ever experienced anything like it and just how close all the guys were. And um, yeah, it was, an, it was amazing to be able to play in those first six games. Um, and I mean, just the fact that I wasn't able to play in the rest of the season didn't, it didn't diminish it at all. Sure. Um, it was obviously hard not to be able to, to join my, my teammates on the field, but um, one thing I learned is that like everyone has a role and um just because you're not on the field doesn't mean that you're any less less part of a team so sure. um it was definitely a great season fun to win it always is and um i'll never forget it so well let's talk about as you move forward obviously we're in spring practice now you're still limited in what you can do mobility wise but mm -hmm. um, how do you use this off season and cheering from the sidelines to prepare you for 2014 yeah, um, I think any time you're able to prepare with the team, it's a very valuable um, process. And I think one thing that us seniors have really been focusing on is um, kind of leading, is it's really stepping up as leaders and helping out the younger guys and kind of showing them what Bethel football is about, what Bethel football off seasons are about, and um, putting in hard work and always um, pushing each other and really um, encouraging each other to be their best and, sure. and in turn make make the team as the best as it can be. Well, one of the things that uh, you're probably well aware, well, well aware of um, is that you have the target on your back now mm -hmm. and as you go into 2014 it's not um, this that or the other team it's Bethel at the top and everybody's yeah. looking to take them down. Yeah. Um, how do you go in with that mentality and how do you keep yourself humble but hungry at the yeah. same time? Um, yeah, that's a good question. I think one thing that we talk about a lot is playing to our standard mm -hmm. and yeah like we had a great season last year um but that that doesn't mean anything like my dad always tells me yesterday's home runs don't win today's games mm -hmm. and so i think i mean as long as we keep on pushing ourselves and striving to be the best that we can be as a team mm -hmm. i think that um we'll have another successful season Thanks so much for the time. Yeah, and, absolutely. Uh, enjoy the spring practice here and the off-season workouts. All right, thanks.